I know everyone's already done this and I'm late to the game, etc, etc. If I'm honest, I filmed this video earlier today and I just sat down to edit it and it was not working out. I had a bunch of like technical problems that I thought I was going to be able to fix later and it just wasn't working out that way. So I just decided to sit down and film it again. I've only seen this video once and that was the time that I recorded it earlier today. I have listened to the entire EP. Spoiler, it is my favorite EXO piece ever. I love all the songs that are in this EP. I feel like they're very relevant, on trend, catchy, just good music. So if you haven't checked it out, check it out. <laughs> But without further ado, I'm gonna be watching EXO's new Don't Fight the Feeling music video. And hopefully, fingers crossed, everything works out this time. Here we go. Okay, the reference to Domo Samba Tempo. We got the phone. I remember when they. What am I doing? Um, I remember when they released the pictures when they were filming this video, and everyone went crazy because we knew that EXO was coming back. I know. Number one in my heart. I am telling you, <laughs> I don't know if it's evident, but clearly Kyungsu is my bias, and I just love watching him. I love watching him. I will say I really like the whole the transitions between the shots. I think that's really well done. Cute. Tenyu has this weird duality where he looks really young, but at the same time, like you know he's not. Like isn't he almost 30 or something? But he he has such a baby face and like his expressions are so um I guess innocent to a certain degree, then it makes him look younger. Love the transitions. I hadn't noticed that before, the like thing. And I love the whole Baekhyun and his girls that's going on right now. I also wanted to mention that I like their makeup in this video because it doesn't look too over the top. It kind of like highlights their own natural features and I think that's really nice. This is such a cute summer, like, feel good song, and I'm so into it. I. No place, no town that we can go. Cute. <laughs> He's so cute. I am so. I didn't notice this the first time I watched it, but I'm so into these transitions. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Another Kai and his girls moment, living for it. Exo Planet, love the references in the back. Baby, I can be a feeling. Tell me where you find the feeling. <laughs> I 
I'm sorry to pause it there, but Theo is such a good performer and that like seeing him outside of the performance um how do you say this in english environment um you would never predict that that he'd be able to captivate people as much as he does um and his voice as we know is beautiful and he's such a great dancer and he looks great and it's just the whole package <laughs> Upgraded to Baekhyun and his girls and boys. I like the storyline. Wait. Okay. okay. Alright. So, love the fact that there's like a storyline referencing to the past um, EXO songs. We had uh, Tempo. I believe it was Power. If there are other ones, please let me know. I think overall, EXO has this ability to somehow stay relevant even though they're not necessarily always active and producing a lot of content like maybe younger newer generation idol groups are and every single time especially these past couple years every single time they release something new even if it's not with the whole group they've just been able to deliver so well another thing that i kind of thought about was i don't think x is necessarily known as a dancer group. I think they have very well recognized vocalists um, and I think the choreography in this video was something that was so well designed for them because it allowed them to shine and you know present the skills that they have in a way that complements them and it's like they look good doing it. The choreography is also very on trend in the sense that it's easy to follow and especially with all the TikTok challenges and whatever that happens nowadays it's it's easier for people to kind of join in on it and and follow it the first time i watched it i didn't really notice the transitions that they used as much and how effortlessly it all kind of um wove one into the other so that was great the colors in it i'm a big fan of k-pop music videos because of the visuals of it and i think most people who are into these sorts of videos um are drawn in because of the visual and the the colors um and the concepts that they have and i think this one definitely like hit it on the spot it's very summer vibe and also i can't not mention the fact that our beloved lay was also included in this video I think I always selfishly wish that he would come back physically and like be with them performing and everything. I know that he's doing his thing and I think everybody who follows this group is always really happy to see that he still makes an effort to, you know, maintain a presence within um, EXO. I love the video in conclusion. The album, the EP, Don't Fight the Feeling is out now. When I say that, it's genuine, like, it is truly, genuinely my favorite EXO album EP group of songs ever released. I love all of them. I think they all did 
incredible. They have, you know, the slow songs, the fun songs. I think it's just so, so well produced in, in general. If you haven't already, make sure you go and watch the video on your own and also stream the new EP, Don't Fight the Feeling, whatever platform you use, Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube, anything. Not only to like get their views up, but because it's genuinely just good music. Yeah, I don't really have much to say. I'll see you guys, I guess, whenever I see you again. Bye.